What's going on guys, I got a pretty cool video for you today. I'm going to be showing you my hut team, but before I do that, I have something to show you. Um, yesterday in the mail, I got this. EA Sports NHL 21 Community Hut Team of the Year Awarded to Tactics HD. I don't know if you guys can see it there. Uh, I just want to say thank you guys. Um, obviously, this is kind of like a made-up award, but I think it's just for people that obviously are active in the NHL 21 community, making videos, streaming, whatever. Uh, it's really cool. Like I don't know if you guys can tell just how big it is. Um, I'm gonna say it's like foot at least, like it's pretty tall. Um, here, I'll give you guys an iPhone for scale. Uh, iPhone 7, Mandalorian background, hopefully you guys like that. So yeah, trophy's pretty big, it's heavy. Uh, it's got the black and gold finish. I think it looks really, really sharp. So yeah, I got some mail yesterday, put it on my social media, check that out if you guys aren't following. But wanted to say thank you guys so much because I just thought that was a really cool award. Wouldn't have gotten it without you guys. Uh, so like I was saying, a lot of people have been asking me kind of what my hut team looks like. So I figured I'd make a video today and just Show you guys my hot team, maybe play a game, show you the stats, um, why I like it, all that stuff. So, first line, we got the 89 Icon Lemieux. Uh, Couture is signing that line, it's the 88 Fancy card, obviously I can keep upgrading him. Uh, right wing there, 90 Svechnikov was the one I picked from the Christmas pack. Um, after that we have Sakic, Eiserman, and Zibanejad on the second line. Zibanejad actually got one of my pack openings uh, from like the untradeable Winter National pack, give you like a gold collectible. Third line, we got Stammer there, playing with Neuendijk and Nugent Hopkins. Uh, Nugent Hopkins is one of like the few tradable cards on this team, you might notice. I think everybody else so far has been untradeable. So uh, basically he fit in well, he's got Howitzer. Uh, with that activated actually, he's got a really nice shot, he's fast. One of the better left-handed um, forwards I think with Howitzer kind of in my price range. Now fourth line, you got 80 Cousins, he's just there for the synergies. Um, Oshi there was one of the cards you get for free. 87 overall, you might be wondering why he's on the fourth line. He hasn't been very good for me. Lining there with him, of course, is my cover choice card. Uh, he's got a really good shot. It's 90, but other than that, he doesn't really have much going for him. So that's why he's kind of on the fourth line. And Cousins actually is the only other tradable forward I have on this team. Uh, defensively here, we got the 87 Fantasy McCarr. Again, I can keep upgrading him with the 91 Team of the Year Headman. Um, obviously, I think that's a nasty top pair. You then got Broberg and Doughty on the second pair. And then you have Hamilton and Potvin on the third pair. Um, Potvin, I got really lucky and pulled in an untradable pack. Um, I think so. Broberg and Hamilton, the only tradables. Hamilton, I think, for the price range, you can't really get much better of a player. Um, with Howitzer, he's got a really big shot. He's quicker. He's 6'6". I think for an 82 base, he's a really nice card to have, especially if, like, for me, he's just a bomb pair guy. And then Broberg, you guys can see he's both his synergies I have activated. They're both player synergies. I also have a couple team synergies. He's insane with all these stats. Like, he's not 85. He's at least probably, I don't know, like an 88. I mean, look at his skating. Uh, his defensive stats, he gets 92 body check, 95 strength after like a double bonus. Uh, D awareness, 92. Like, uh, with all the synergies going on, he's just such a good card. Um, I'll show you guys goal tanking as well. So, my starter there, Ben Bounds. Hopefully, I said his name right. Uh, basically, I got him for the synergies. It's plus two to Spark. But he's actually played really well for me. Uh, you guys can kind of see a quick look at the stats. I'll show you guys some highlights from him later on. But um, I got him for the synergies, and it turned out he's actually a pretty solid goalie. Uh, the core there, obviously as the backup just there for synergy. So speaking of all the synergies, I wanna show you guys, um, I've got both Spark and Distributor. That was a big thing I wanted with this team. Um, both of those as I get a plus uh, four to acceleration and a plus three to speed for the entire team. They're so much faster with both of these. Uh, I used to just run Distributor, adding Spark was very noticeable. I'm just beating guys, as obviously my guys are now accelerating faster uh, to their top speed. Howitzer is one of the best player synergies, so all these guys get another boost of speed and agility on top of Spark and Distributor, which is pretty nuts. So uh, these six guys in particular are just going to be flying out there, which like I said, just makes Broberg so good. Um, Shutdown, I got on these three defensemen, just makes them all such better defensemen. Body check, puck control, shot block, slap shot accuracy, and then Gladiator was one I just kind of ended up getting. Um, Eisman, Line A, and Neuendijk, and Broberg. I actually got uh, Neuendijk from just like the 85 Icon pack. was hoping for uh, McInnes. I actually was like going to go towards... Um, a Magician synergy, but didn't get him and Neuendijk actually ended up working out pretty well. Also guys, before I forget, I showed you Oshi's face-off stats. I should show you the other three centermen as well. Honestly, they all are really good face-offs. Uh, Kachiri there, 90, only gonna get better. Eijerman, 88, and I believe Neuendijk has 91. So I think, you know, having those three guys in the middle uh, definitely has helped me out a lot in the face-off circle. I'll give you guys a quick look at special teams as well. I feel like you probably don't care too much. Obviously, you just need to, you know, throwing your best players out there. I tried to do my best to make it balanced, so uh, you know, you're giving certain guys a break, like I don't want to kind of run Lemieux constantly, so I don't think I have him on the PK, that way he has more endurance when he is out there on his regular line or power play, whatever. Fiddler, of course, 
is the coach. So really happy with this team. They've been playing really well for me. I think I'm just going to jump into a game right now for you guys and, and kind of show you the team in action. And speaking of that, you guys might see at the bottom there, I'm registered for the next Hut Champions. This is going to be the first Hut Champions I've actually ever played in. So I think, you know, this team is a big reason for that. Also too, I was, you know, grinding a bit last weekend, playing a bunch of games. Um, but yeah, this team's definitely improved my gameplay for sure. So here you go, guys. Uh, matched up with someone. You've got Taze there, first line center. Let's see what we can do here. Cars quick. Lemieux. Nice chance. I'm, who is that goal? <laughs> I was gonna say, I don't know who that goalie is. He's got net, but uh, just dunked on this fetch. Wow, this guy just walks in, snipes one, one, one. Sack it. Come on, beat him. Beat him. He's tired. He was out there before. Wow, we just lost it. No way. That was like a slow mo goal. The way it just trickled in. Come on, cross crease. Oh, Nuge gets his own rebound. I'll, I'll take that. We're on the PK here, hoping to kill this thing off. I feel like the team's got some pretty good PKers. Um, a lot of guys, really good defensive stats. Oh, what a move. Fetch. Wait, wait. Ah, hoping for that cross crease to open up. Heavens out of the box. Give it back. Oh, he gets. Oh! Nice try. <sighs> that one hurts. I was on the first pass, I had a guy on the second pass, but it goes right through him. Alright, we gotta come back in this one now. Here we go, Hamilton. Find him on the cross crease. Oh, good sure, yeah, you gotta bury that. Up front again. No one there. Mew. Find somebody. Svetch. Walk out front. There we go. 3-3, three, three. we got a game. Here we go, Broberg. Sabanajad. 4-3, let's go. Oh, nice poke, Nuge. He's coming up, he's coming up. Didn't quite get the angle I wanted with Stammer. Just took a penalty with 30 seconds to go. It's gonna be a close one. Nice save. Oh my god. Another nice one. Big poke, big poke. Another one. Browns with the glove, 0.4 seconds. I think we're able to just hold on and barely win this one. And next you guys, I want to show you this team's stats. It's like I was saying, they've been playing very, very well for me. I'll show you the player stats and the goalie stats. The goalie basically shows us the record with this team. So um, hopefully, yeah, it's sorted by points. Lemieux's got 47 and 34. Uh, if you guys didn't know, Lemieux's an absolute beast. Highly recommend, you know, saving up your icon collectibles uh, to make him. Eisman's played very well for me, basically a point per game. Sackick, I think at one point was doing better than Eisman, but now Eisman's better. So they're pretty similar, I'd say. Especially there's a goal scorer. He's got 18 and 21. Um, free Christmas card, 31 points, 21 games. Ridiculous. Um, Line A there, again, 49 games played. Should have probably more points, but he's got really good shots. Stammer's played really good for me. I randomly got him, I think, in a mini pack. Couldn't believe it. Uh, one included my team. I really like uh, the base Stammer card. Oshi kind of summoned a line A, a bit underperforming. Couture, over a point per game. Can't ask for more than that. Dowdy's another guy. Got like in a random premium pack, maybe from doing some jerseys. Solid defenseman. Um, Potfin, I think, you know, has been pretty good for me as well. Nuge there, 15 and 21. Very good card. Zamanja has been pretty solid. Nuendijk actually surprised me how well he's played. Um, a card for a defenseman. Can't really ask much more than that. 10 points, 16 games with a plus 24. Not too bad. Uh, Hamilton there has got nine as a bottom pairing guy. Cousins is only an 80. He's got seven points, 16 games. It's pretty good as well. Um, Victor Hedman, team of the year. You actually might expect more than seven points, but plus 24, like he plays solid defensively. Uh, Broberg there, 4.16 games, not too bad. Again, I think with all the boosts, he plays a lot better. Now, goalies, so you guys can see, with this team, my record is 13-3. and three. Now, my third loss was actually an OT loss, so I'd be 13-2-1, which for me is a really good record. I'm sure some people are going to say um, their record's better. I don't care. For me, that's a really good record. As well for a hot goalie, a 3.16 goals against an 82.19 save percentage is really good. Uh, his first three games, he actually played amazing. He had like less than one goal against. His save percentage was like 95 plus. I'll show a pick on screen. You guys can see what I'm talking about. Like he was absolutely ridiculous. Since then, he's come down to earth a bit more, but still has played really solid for me in net. And again, I was basically stuck with him as he had the two points of spark, which I needed. So really glad to see him actually playing well for me. It's basically like the best of both worlds. Playing well, giving me the synergy I need. So again, overall, Really nothing bad I can say about this team. I've had a ton of fun with it. Um, I'll just show you guys really quickly in case anyone wants to know um, what my strategies are. I've had that question a couple times. Um, really nothing crazy. It's kind of just what I've used like the past five years. Um, I'll just kind of show you that really quick. If you want to, you can like pause the screen. 
Um, offense and all that stuff, I think is basically the same, but um, I've actually got a few packs to open up for you guys. Um, it's my rival rewards. I think I just finished the highest I ever have in rivals. Uh, I ever finished platinum or diamond, I'm not sure. I know it's bouncing back between the two. Uh, so we got one jungle NHL players pack and lead pack, and I just got this base pack from some weekly rewards or something. So I'll open this up quick, because it's probably going to have trash. 250 coins. Yeah, I, I don't have like any luck usually with like the free base and the premiums, but um, the Elite and the Players Pack, hopefully we get something here. I chose Tradable because I'm happy with my team, so even if I get somebody pretty good with the Untradable, chances are there's not going to be a spot for them in my team, which case is kind of a waste. Um, but if we get somebody huge here, uh, I could sell them for a bunch of coins. So, Kachur's not bad, Galchanyak, Doomnik, okay, so... Uh, that pack definitely could have been better. We got one more to open up here. It's our third pack, and Dreisel's on the front. Dreisel 3. Kind of upset, obviously. No Dreisel on this team. Or McDavid. Carey Price, 86 overall. We get a purple. Okay, I mean, it's a base card. It's a goalie, but um, you definitely could do worse with your rival rewards. <laughs> Price and Ovechkin. Same pack. Are you kidding me? I actually got an OB on my first pack of Evangel 21. I know they're both bases, but wow. Oh God, that's awesome. Price and Ovechkin. Um, if we could get a special card, I don't want to be too... Freddie Anderson, 83. I was going to say, if we get a special card as well, it'd be pretty sick. Another Dubnik. Okay, I'm not going to complain though. Yeah, like, I know they're base cards, but... An Ovechkin and a Price, same pack. Can I get them? There you go, yeah. You can see them both. That is pretty awesome. So that's where we're going to end this video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, leave that thumbs up. Again, I couldn't have gotten that Hut TV Video trophy without you guys, so I really appreciate all the support. And as always, guys, thanks so much for watching. Have a nice day. Goodbye.